So here we have a Maxus e Deliver 3 electric van. These are also called the Maxus or LDV EV30 in other markets. And I've been asked a few times, well, actually it's the fourth time this morning now, from people who want to convert these to campers, and they're asking, can you fit swivelling seats in the front? So the quick answer is, I don't know, because I don't do that sort of work, but I thought I'll film this video and show you what the seats are like, and then obviously you can make your own judgement, and then in the future I can refer people to this video. So, let's first off look at... Um, the driver's side so the seats are obviously on rails as they all are and they're simply on these metal well again metal rails there box section and I've just slid the seat forward and you can see there there's another foot there a square platform and I'm not sure whether you can see there it's a bit dark but yeah you've got a, a box section there with a box section here this is hollow under here so you've got two very nice flat surfaces that you could mount a swiveling plate on so that looks relatively easy but as i said i've never done it before so i'm no expert with this sort of thing so here on the passenger side i've just removed the um, charge cables because they usually sit under the seat and it's exactly the same you've got these uh, four boxes in each corner and uh, you've got this fabric sort of hardboard type material going along here to cover up the cavity the gap and this is just held on with some plastic push clips so yeah it looks like it would be a nice easy job to fit a swiveling plate on there you could bolt that to these box steel and then bolt your rails your seat rails onto your swiveling plate so much easier than many other vans where the feet of the van sit at different heights and different levels. So I've just got a torch so I'll put the camera underneath there so you can see what I can see. I'll also take some dimensions if you're interested in this as well so outside edge of that box section to this one is 44 centimeters and each is roughly eight centimeters wide as well and then from the back edge to the front edge you're looking at 655 millimeters approximately and this box section is approximately 12 centimeters tall so i'll just show you underneath the driver's seat We've got the puncher repair kit there, but yeah, exactly the same arrangement. The other thing to note, of course, is there is a wire going up into the seats because these have heated front seats on both sides as standard. Oh, and the other thing you might want to know, the seat belt buckle is bolted to that sliding rail as well. So no problems there either. The seats on the Maxus are also very nice they're very sculptured and look good for a van much better than normal van seats you also get an adjustable armrest on both sides as well i have seen some reports on the internet that the fabric's not particularly hard wearing um, and they wear on these bolsters but then so do all van seats if you're going to be sliding in and out your van all day you really want to be fitting uh, seat covers to protect the fabric um, but yeah they're very nice seats for a van and uh, I suspect very comfortably if you're going to be sitting in it a lot as you would if you had a camper. You also have a leather steering wheel as standard and it is adjustable that way. Not a great deal but it doesn't go in and out that's the only adjustment you have on it. The bulkhead looks like it is removable pretty easily as well. I've done another video about that which I'll put a link at the top of the screen and also in the video description below. So that's it for this one. If you found this video useful, please do click that thumbs up button on YouTube. That really does help and it allows other people to find the channel. And if you want to know more about these vans, the Maxus e Deliver 3 electric van, I'll put a link in the video description below where you can go to a playlist and look at other videos I've made on these vans. Okie doke, I'll see you on the next video.